Keith Cole claims the AI master key has a chance to grow almost 5,000% in the next three years. The only problem is Cole wants you to pay him to reveal what the AI master key is. But I have good news. He left enough clues in this presentation to figure out the name of the stock and I reveal it in this video completely free. If you appreciate me saving you money and revealing this stock for free, the only thing I ask in return is that you like this video and subscribe for future free stock giveaways. Let's get started. Before I reveal the stock Keith is pitching, let's take a look at his track record and stock picks in the last five years. In January 2021, Keith recommended Acoustis, which is a company specializing in radio frequency bulk acoustic wave filters, which are used in high power, high frequency, and ultra wideband solutions for applications such as Wi-Fi, 5G infrastructure, mobile, automotive, and defense markets. The stock doubled in the month after Keith recommended it before completely crashing and losing all value. Most people likely lost a lot of money with this pick. In August 2021, Cole recommended Lightbridge, which is a company that develops advanced nuclear fuel technology designed to enhance the economics, safety, and proliferation resistance of nuclear power, using proprietary fuel that operates significantly cooler than standard fuels. The stock has been extremely volatile in the last few years and has had very brief moments where it surged, but overall it's been mainly down. In January 2022, Cole recommended LiCycle, which is a company specializing in lithium-ion battery recycling, focusing on recovering critical materials from all types of lithium-ion batteries through a patented spoke and hub technologies process to create a closed-loop battery supply chain. Keith claimed this company could solve America's lithium problem. That didn't seem to be the case, though and the stock has completely crashed since Keith recommended it. In January 2023, Keith recommended Philips 66, which is a diversified energy manufacturing and logistics company that processes, transports, stores, and markets fuels and products globally with operations spanning refining, chemicals, midstream, and marketing segments. He claimed this company would solve America's diesel problem. I'm not sure if it did that, but it has done well since Keith recommended it. In January 2023, Keith called Unity Biotechnology the number one stock of this generation. Unity Biotechnology is a company focused on developing therapeutics to slow, halt, or reverse diseases of aging by targeting cellular senescence and age-related biology, particularly in ophthalmologic and neurologic diseases. Since being recommended by Cole, the stock has lost a lot of value. In March 2020, Keith recommended Canaan as a way to make a million dollars. Canaan is a technology company that focuses on designing high-performance computing chips, producing computing equipment, and offering software services. It mostly makes products for Bitcoin mining. This stock has had a pretty wild ride. It doubled after Keith recommended it, then quickly lost 50% of its value, and then about a year later went up 1,000%. I'm sure some people panicked and lost money, but those who sold at the peak made 30 years of gains in a month. In December 2023, Keith recommended Matador Resources, which is an independent energy company that focuses on the exploration, development, production, and acquisition of oil and natural gas resources, primarily in shale and other unconventional plays, with operations centered in the Delaware Basin, Eagle Ford Shale, and Haynesville Shale. Keith claimed they invented a new fracking drill that could cut costs of fracking. The stock did surge for a little, but has since returned to break even. Let's switch back to the teaser and explain what Keith means when he says AI master key. Keith is saying what a lot of other stock pickers are currently saying. Our energy grid won't be able to handle the demands of AI. The current energy consumption of AI is substantial and growing rapidly. As AI models and applications continue to expand, their energy demands are expected to increase significantly. By 2027, the AI sector's annual energy consumption could be comparable to that of the Netherlands. In 2022, data centers in the United States consumed about 200 terawatt hours of electricity, representing 4% of the country's total electricity demand. This consumption is projected to rise to 260 terawatt hours by 2026 due to the growth in AI and cloud services. Additionally, individual AI tasks can be energy intensive. For example, a single chat GPT query uses approximately 2.9 watt hours, significantly more than a typical Google search. The rapid increase in AI's computational power, doubling roughly every 100 days, further exacerbates its energy footprint. And like many other stock pickers, Keith is recommending nuclear energy as the solution to AI's energy demands. And nuclear is the AI master key. Nuclear energy can address the energy demands of AI by providing a stable, high capacity power source with low carbon emissions. Nuclear power plants generate large amounts of electricity without producing greenhouse gases during operation. 
making them a cleaner alternative to fossil fuels. This is crucial for data centers and AI operations, which require substantial and consistent energy supplies. Additionally, advancements in nuclear technology, such as small modular reactors, offer scalable and flexible solutions that can be integrated into various locations, including those close to data centers. SMRs can be constructed more quickly and with lower upfront costs compared to traditional nuclear reactors, facilitating faster deployment to meet increasing energy demands. Keith left us plenty of clues for the nuclear stock he wants you to buy. Firstly, the stock is under $3. Secondly, this company has a partnership with the Department of Energy. Additionally, the company's technology plays a pivotal role in the SMR operation, housing uranium pellets that serve as the nuclear fuel. And lastly, they have a partnership with Southern Company, Exelon Generation Company, and Dominion Energy. I'm going to reveal the stock in the next section, but before I do that, I want to remind you to click the link in the description to check out Insider Newsletter. I've reviewed over 100 stock picking services. An insider newsletter gets the best returns. And for a limited time, it's only $1 to try. The company Keith is pitching is one he's pitched many times in his career, which is Lightbridge. He's basically rebranded the pick as an AI play because all stock pickers recommend AI stocks these days. Lightbridge Corporation is an advanced nuclear fuel technology company based in the United States. The company focuses on developing and commercializing next generation nuclear fuel that aims to enhance the economics and safety of existing and new nuclear reactors. Lightbridge's proprietary metallic fuel technology offers significant advantages, including increased power output, improved reactor safety margins, and reduced nuclear waste. As of June 2024, the company's stock has faced a notable decline, starting the year at around $3.20 per share and decreasing by approximately 20.2% to around $2.50 per share. This drop reflects broader market challenges and specific company issues. Financially, Lightbridge has not yet achieved profitability. The company reported a net income loss of $7.91 million for the most recent fiscal year. Additionally, key financial metrics such as earnings per share are negative, currently standing at negative 68 cents. Lightbridge's return on equity is negative 30%, indicating significant losses relative to shareholders' equity. On the balance sheet, Lightbridge maintains a strong liquidity position with a current ratio and quick ratio of 31.25, supported by $27.94 million in cash and no debt. This financial stability is crucial for the company as it continues to invest in its advanced nuclear fuel technology. Operationally, Lightbridge has been active in industry collaborations and strategic developments. Recently, the company entered into a contract with Centris Energy to conduct a front-end engineering and design study for a pilot fuel fabrication facility in Ohio. This partnership highlights Lightbridge's commitment to advancing its technology and scaling up production capabilities. Despite the financial losses, Lightbridge's strategic initiatives, including its engagement in industry events and discussions on nuclear energy's role in the energy transition, suggest a focus on long-term growth. In summary, while Lightbridge faces current financial challenges, its robust cash position, strategic partnerships, and active industry engagement provide a foundation for potential future growth. Investors should consider both the risks associated with the company's ongoing losses and the potential upside from its innovative nuclear fuel technologies. And if you really want to make money with the stock market, make sure to click the link in the description to check out Insider Newsletter. I've reviewed hundreds of stock picking newsletters and Insider Newsletter performs the best by far. On top of this, it's only $1 to try. So again, click the link in the description to check out this newsletter.